Hello again, I'm Dr. Jerry Tan. I'm a Mayo Clinic trained endocrinologist. For today, we'll discuss about the saga of hidden calories, the culprits of why you're not losing weight. Here are some of the hidden calories that you may be taking every day without knowing it. Number one, the low-fat yogurt. Yogurt can be highly nutritious, but like many other low-fat products, low-fat yogurts often contain added sugar to enhance their flavor. Now, of note, what I'm going to give you in terms of calories would be from a single cup of approximately 245 grams of low-fat yogurt that may contain as much as 40 grams to 45 grams of sugar, which is about 11 teaspoons. This is more than the daily limit for men and women. Number two, barbecue sauce. We know that barbecue sauce is what makes our beef or marinated meat tasty. However, two tablespoons of your barbecue sauce of around 28 grams can give you around nine grams of sugar, which is equivalent to around two teaspoons of sugar. Number three, of course, what we love most with french fries or with egg omelette would be our ketchup, which is one of the most popular condiments in the Philippines and also worldwide. Unfortunately, because it's sweet, it contains sugar. And in fact, a single tablespoon of ketchup will contain nearly one teaspoon of sugar. Number four, spaghetti sauce. Now, Filipinos loved our version of sweet spaghetti. Unfortunately, since the sauce is sweet, they have added sugar. So all spaghetti sauces will contain some natural sugar, given the fact that they are made with tomatoes. The best way, however, to ensure that you aren't getting any unwanted sugar in your pasta sauce is preferably to make your own. Number five, chocolate milk. Now, chocolate milk we know is nutritious, but it has been flavored with cocoa and is sweetened with sugar. So despite having all the nutritious qualities of milk, one cup of chocolate milk of around 250 grams will contain almost 12 extra grams or equivalent to two to three teaspoons of added sugar. Number six, granola. Now, granola is considered a healthy alternative for breakfast because it is made of oats, but Without you realizing it, it is actually combined with nuts and honey and other sugar-added sweeteners, which can increase the amount of sugars and calories in it. So in fact, 100 grams of granola can contain as much as 400 to 500 calories, nearly 5 to 7 teaspoons of sugar. Number seven, of course, what we love most, the flavored coffees. It's a popular trend, but in some coffee houses, for example, one large flavored coffee or coffee drink can contain as much as 45 grams of sugar, if not much more. So that's equivalent again to 11 teaspoons of added sugar per serving. It is therefore best that if you want coffee, it should be blocked without cream or without sugar, without any flavored syrups. Number eight, iced tea. If you go to buffets, iced tea is always there because it's cheap and it's tasty. But it is usually laden with sugar and flavored with syrup. So most commercially available prepared iced teas, for example, will contain as much as 35 grams of sugar per 340 ml serving. This is about the same amount of sugar in a bottle of regular Coke. Number nine, breakfast cereal. Some cereals, for example, those marketed for children, really have lots of added sugar. Some, in fact, contain 12 grams or 3 teaspoons of sugar in a 34-gram serving. So the bottom line is added sugars are everywhere. It can be in our condiments. It can be in our usual meal. It can be in our usual sauces, which we don't know that they contain sugar. But long term, this will actually cause harm, especially if you consume large amounts of these hidden calories. So the best way, therefore, to avoid these hidden sugars in your meal is preferably to make these foods in your own home, as you exactly know what's in them. Make sure also, if you buy stuff prepared in groceries, to check the label to identify any hidden added sugars, especially when you're buying this for your family. Again, this is Dr. Jerry Tan. Stay safe. See you again soon.